First look at MIUI 10 Global Stable version 10.3.8.0 based on Android 9.0 Pi running on the Xiaomi POCO F1. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos. Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And in this video, we're going to have a first look at MIUI 10 Global Stable version 10.3.8.0 based on Android 9.0 Pi. Right off the bat, you will notice that the security patch is from September 2019. I guess that deserves a round of applause for Xiaomi because finally they managed to roll out a security patch for that month in that month because previous builds used to have a security patch which was like a month or maybe even two months old. So really, I appreciate your hard work here. Xiaomi, other than that, if you go into settings, you will see a new option called digital well-being. This is something which Google had added in Android 9.0 Pi, but Xiaomi never implemented it and now we do see it in this build of MIUI 10.3.8.0 stable. Digital well-being will tell you how much time you spent in certain applications, how many times you've unlocked your phone, how many notifications you've received. If you click on dashboard and then click on this drop down, you can choose screen time, notifications received, times open, and accordingly you will have a weekly graph here along with all the applications. So, you know, it tells you how addicted you are to your phone and how much time you spend on your phone. Now if you want to limit the time you spend in a certain application all you have to do is make sure that screen time is selected then click on show all applications click on the application click on app timer and now I can set an application timer for whatever application I want to and that way once you know you spent that amount of time in that application the icon will be grayed out and you will get a notification message that you are trying to spend more time than you decided on this application. So that is what digital well-being is about. You can also configure your wind down if you want. You can manage your notifications as well and also configure your do not disturb. And then we also have the toggle to show the icon in the app list. So if we enable this toggle and then go to our app drawer, we will see the option for digital well-being in the application drawer. Other than that, if you go into settings and then let's go into display, you do not have the option for dark theme, which I'm pretty sure Xiaomi will add with MIUI 11. However, if you want to enable dark theme on MIUI 10, I have a separate video for that, which is linked in the description of this video. And it will also pop up as a card on the top right of your screen. If you go into settings and then notifications and status bar, you do have the option of show icons for incoming notification, but your notifications are still shown for a small amount of time and then it's replaced by that time, you know. I'm sick and tired of calling out Xiaomi for this because this is a feature which has been requested ever since they made this mistake. They are yet to fix it and I'm pretty sure they're not gonna fix it now. Maybe, you know, 1% hope they're gonna fix it in MIUI 11 but I personally have lost all hope that they are going to fix this. Other than that, about touchscreen issues, I personally never had any touchscreen issues. Touch word on my POCO F1. However, if you had any touchscreen issues on your POCO F1 or you had any ghost touches and this build of MIUI 10.3.8.0 fix that, make sure to let us know via comments below so that you know other peeps can read it and try it out if it fixes the touchscreen issues on their POCO F1. As for the benchmark score, these are the benchmark scores which I got on this MIUI 10.3.8.0 build running on the Xiaomi POCO F1. However, do know Benchmark scores are overrated and they do not reflect the correct performance of a ROM. And that will do it for this video peeps. This was our first look at MIUI 10 Global Stable version 10.3.8.0 based on Android 9.0 Pi running on the Xiaomi POCO F1. I hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.